Dr. Jeff Lehrman, podiatrist, certified coder, and consultant to AP May's Health Policy and Practice Department. This video is being recorded on March 25th, 2020. We share the date because things are changing so rapidly, and this video should serve as an update to the last video that we posted regarding non-face-to-face -face services that we can provide during the COVID-19 public health emergency. There are four non-face-to-face -face services that we can provide for our patients. The first is utilizing our office E&M codes when those same services are performed remotely. So we can use 99201 through 99215 when performing those services remotely. That option exists for Medicare Part B patients, Medicare Advantage patients, and some private payers have actually mirrored that same guidance. That option requires the use of live, interactive, two-way audio and visual communication tool. The second option is for Medicare Part B patients and Medicare Advantage patients only, and that's using the Medicare only code G2012 for a virtual check-in. For that option, we can use any communication tool and it must be an established patient. The third option is for telephone E&M services. This is an option for any insurance patient. However, many insurances don't pay for that service, so you need to check with the individual insurance to know whether they pay for it or not. That, of course, uses the telephone. And the final option is online digital evaluation and management services. Also an option for a patient with any insurance, but again, some insurances do not reimburse that service. That service requires online digital communication like text message or email. Each of these four services have different guidelines, different regulations, different restrictions, and all of those details can be found at apma.org forward slash emremote.